Hey y'all, welcome back. Today I'm going to show you how I make my pot roast. It's very, very simple and quick. The items you will need are a, a pot roast. Um, this is a chuck roast. It's about two and a half pounds. Some potatoes. Um, if you like onions and carrots, feel free to throw that in there. We don't eat them, so we just put in potatoes. This is a McCormick seasoning bag in season pot roast, and it's what makes this whole meal just wonderful. And you'll need a dish to bake it in, and then three cups of water. Now the directions on the back are gonna tell you to only add a quarter cup of water. No, add three cups. Trust me, I've tried this many years I've been doing this, and it gives you a lot of gravy that you can throw over your potatoes and your roast, and it just makes it so much better when you do it this way. First thing you're gonna do is go ahead and prepare your vegetables. I've already peeled my potatoes and I've washed them. Um, then you're going to get your seasoning bag. It's gonna have two sides here. One side says open for the cooking bag, number one, and then the other side says open to the seasoning mix so first of all we're going to just spin that one backwards and we're going to open up the side one and pull out our cooking bag just in here it comes with a little twist tie inside Put that to the side Lay it in our dish. I like to then go ahead and place the roast inside the bag. And then simply put all your vegetables around your roast. Now the seasoning mix, we'll open it up and mix it with our three cups of water. Give it a little stir. We're gonna pour it over the whole roast and all of the vegetables. Then we will seal the bag, poke a few holes in the top Put it in our oven, which is preheated to 350 degrees. We'll leave it in there for about two hours. And that's it, you're done. Seal up our bag. Just let the steam out, then put it in your oven for two hours. Okay, so it's been two hours and we're gonna go ahead and pull this pot roast out. That oven is hot. Okay. Now what I like to do is I go ahead and I open the bag. Be careful of the steam. It is very hot. It will burn you. So be very careful. Don't put your face over it. And just take the little tab off and let it open up a little bit. Get a little bit of steam out of there. Then what I like to do is I like to take my kitchen scissors and just run it right down the center of the top of the bag, just so it can sit here and rest and cool for a few minutes. 
before I dish it out. And that's it. Dish it out and enjoy. I hope you've enjoyed this video and if you did, give me a like and a thumbs up.